urbanization is calling for changes within Houston City Council. LULAC says the Hispanic population in Houston continues to grow and they do not have fair representation. Now they're demanding a major overhaul of the City Council seats. Our Michael Aparty is live downtown tonight at City Hall with a closer look at their demands. Michael? Christine, as you pointed out, the group says that the Hispanic population in our area has been growing by leaps and bounds, but they don't feel like that's reflected on City Council. Tonight calls for changes to Houston City Council. What we're asking for is equitable representation and at least parity. Dr. Sergio Lira is co-chair of Houston LULAC's redistricting task force. He credits a growing Latino community for the growth in Houston and Harris County. But the issue is is why do we only have one representative on city council? Why don't we have equitable representation in all our institutions in Houston? The group is asking for the elimination of the city's five at-large council seats and for four new districts to be created. Where it would allow more Latinos to run for office and truly have the community be represented. Not everyone supports that change, including Dr. Letitia Plummer, who holds one of those at-large seats. Eliminating at-large positions, I don't believe, is the answer. Do we need more Hispanic representation? Presentation? Absolutely. She says several positions will open in 2024 and pointed out. Even if we eliminate the, the five at large um, positions, it doesn't guarantee that those five positions will be um, a Hispanic person could win those seats. And she says members elected at large or citywide can work on broader issues that are not limited to one district. If the proposal were to move forward, the council member says it would ultimately require an amendment to the city's charter. Reporting live outside of City Hall downtown, Michael Lopardi, KPRC 2 News.